So guys, welcome back to another episode of Satisfactory Update 6. This will be episode 16. Uh, as you guys can see, there's a slight difference with some stuff from previous episodes. Uh, last Saturday, around this 7pm EST, I did a live stream <clears throat> right after the um episode 15 came out i did a live stream of satisfactory way i ran around doing some aesthetic stuff doing some optimization with the oil processing and stuff um just a quick update on all the stuff that i did in the live stream the oil processing now produces a byproduct which is petroleum chunks i found a use for that now the petroleum chunks are used to power all the trucks so i no longer have any of my tractors running off of the coal so coal is mainly used to do anything else like steel and stuff uh, we did unlock the manufacturing last episode i think we did it last episode yeah uh so now we have that unlocked we have a couple of steps before we uh are able to build well before yeah before we are able to build the manufacturing building we have to uh, automate the he production of heavy modular frames which takes a lot of stuff so i think that's what we're gonna do this episode we're gonna focus on getting heavy modular frames automated uh, i just have to go over what we need to create that and uh, we get on to that if you're wondering this um building here is what's creating the um fuel for the trucks i did also put a <clears throat> grinder here to grind off some of the excess so it doesn't pile up so that I, I can continuously be creating plastic and rubber turn out any issues for the residues um we are gonna check let's double check what we need for heavy modular frames so we know where we can put the base heavy modular frames all right so we need modular frames which we have here by the steel we have that down there also okay so based on what we see we need that weight was that for stuff or oh, crap we have to make a um a manufacturer to actually start producing the heavy modular frames uh and the manufacturer takes 10 heavy modular frames uh so i need steel pipes and uh, modular frames okay let me run the steel pipes are up this direction So yeah, I'm gonna run get that steel pipes and then I have to run back down to the steel base to get the modular frames. Oh, by the way, that's the long pipe that the um, oil residue from the plastic process production and rubber production a byproduct. That's where it's going. You guys were wondering about that. Oh, also we did, as I'm running here, I just remembered, we did also do some aesthetic stuff on stream Saturday. Um, let come here for. It always hits that pipes. I, I don't really bother with it too much. Actually, yeah. plastics on this side, the um, rubber is on the other side of that building. We did do a bit of aesthetic stuff last on the stream after last episode. We also added this little section to the copper tower. The copper tower now has walls. I now have doors also. So, yeah, and I have signs. So we added this section to the copper tower, which produces... A small amount of circuit boards if we need it in the future. So I'll leave that doing that. I finally unlocked the walls where you can pass the conveyor through. So yeah. 
her stuff looking a bit neater. I also finished up the iron first iron building that we built. So that's now completed. The copper building is now completed also. If you guys got a color for those buildings, let me know. Alright, I came up here for the pipes and I ran way past where the pipes are. Oh, god damn it. Pipes are down on this truck station here. I got 400. Let's queue up what we have to build. I'm going to get some cables and some plastics. Uh, plastics are down here, I can grab that one time. I don't have inventory space. Okay. Oh, I had a bunch of coal on me from switching out the um Chico's. I grab some plastic. Let's go grab the um Cables, which is in the copper tower, no says. Alright, we got the cables. Um, we also need the heavy modular frames, which we have to go back down to the steel building to get the um the modular frames is down there now we have to go back to the steel building get the heavy modular frames just missed my ride but whatever It's gonna run out of fuel. <laughs> I did that on purpose. It's it's a kind of a trick there. I did that on purpose to catch up with it. I got a free drop off down there. Alright, now we're at the steel building. We are possibly going to do the production stuff upstairs. On the third floor of this building here. Most likely. That's where we're gonna do the production for the um Because the industrial case beams are already up there. And the module frames is the floor below. So it's more suitable to actually do this stuff up there. Um, it's not what I need. And what I need is actually on the second floor ship. Now. Mm. 
me just run to this crafting bench here. Alright, so we need 20 heavy modular frames. Let me craft three. I'm locking on the um, screws. It's a hundred screws per month for frame. So I need a crap ton of screws. I should have some screws being produced down here. It's backed up. I was supposed to do this as a two. Alright, the screws are right around here. Not 500 screws on this. Alright, I think I should have enough to. If it's 100 screws per. You're gonna increase 5 it. Wow! Why do I need so much screws? Um. Rods, rods, rods. Let me get a bunch of rods. I got some rods here and I'm gonna manually create some screws. So I nearly did at least 2,000 screws. A crap. These computers are cheaper to make. Alright guys, I'm gonna sit here for a while just creating screws. Uh, probably go into a bell montage now while I sit and create some screws. Time lapse section. For all you guys who are watching on YouTube, you can get access to the full video, film montage, um, thought process, and all the stuff that goes on during the film montage that you guys wouldn't normally get access to on Patreon. So, why does there are a lot of inventory space?
I'm gonna jump down and do what is hog down here. Let's see how we're doing on power. We're fully charged. The battery is fully charged. Uh, we have a good bit, yeah. Power is decent, yeah. Might have an issue, but we have some stored power just in case. Alright. Alright, guys. We are finally done with the bin montage. Um, we had a bit of issues. Um, yeah, to say the least. But we got everything solved. We decided to switch some stuff in between building. And I think we got everything sorted out. Got to expand the, to the back of this base a bit here. Uh, probably by the time this video is released, I'll probably do some stuff on a stream where I block off the back of the base. Uh, make it look a bit neater. Let me just make sure everything's running down here. And if... This is the beam, sorry. Okay, this T iron just started coming in. There it is. Is there another limestone there? I'm like cool. Uh, let's see, first bunch of screws created by steel. It's gonna head upstairs and for production. Um, I made a bit of a crazy noodle conundrum here, so yeah, don't mind that. Oh, so where is this pulling from? This mine may have to be upgraded, but yeah. See, it's pulling from the second one. Oh no, that one's actually pulling from the top. Okay, that one will have to um, either be upgraded to produce two, two times the amount or just overclocked. Probably just upgraded. It's a better one. Okay, if you guys enjoyed the episode, if you guys want to see more satisfactory on the channel, feel free to drop a like at that subscribe. Also, there will be a new series coming to the channel. It's probably would probably be released already. Um, we're going to start a series First Look Fridays where I take a first look into some games. Some of them will be new, some of them will be already released for a while and had an update recently. Uh, yeah, so if you guys are interested in checking out some games, that will be on Fridays, once I have a game to um, first look. Um, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. As you can see now, for the thumbnail, this is probably going to be thumbnail. As you can see, that there is the manufacturers. We got two manufacturers upstairs creating heavy modular frames. Oof. It was a bit of a long build montage, but anyway, there it is. See you guys in the next episode next week. Also, live stream on Twitch at 7 p.m. EST when this video comes out, which is Saturday. But most likely be a satisfactory live stream. I did just get a new webcam, so you guys can see my beautiful face. And you guys, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm out.